Oh my god, which is... Oh, oh glorious. Our tank is now... Oh, crap. And physics again. Uh, we're sinking. Because there's a tank on the back. <laughs> um... Ah, the tank's getting launched. Oh, no, the tank is not getting launched. Oh my gosh, <laughs> what is this? Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of The Unturned. Um, in today's episode, we're going to be floating this tank across a river. Um, now, you may be asking, how am I going to do this? Because this thing is huge, and it will just probably sink right into the water. Um, don't worry about that. I have a plan. I, I saw a boat while we were flying one time. And I think we can modify it to carry this. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Fire zombies, because you can't take them out in close range, otherwise you'll get hurt. Oh, what what is this? Oh my gosh, why is there, like, what? Oh, okay. How do we miss this? Th there's a million helicopters in here. H how far does this go up? I need to know, I need to... Is this infinite? Is this from, like, every time... There's only two, but I'm not sure how we're going to get those out of here. Um, and it's basically empty all the way there, all the way, the rest of the way up. This will give us a chance to paraglide our way into town, of course. Just so that way we don't have to deal with as many zombies, so. I couldn't find a gas mask, so we're going to have to go to another town, unfortunately. Um, I think there's one down this way. Possibly. I don't know if it has what we're looking for, but it's a, there's a good chance that we'll find something that we can use, because we really need to get a boat to do this, and I decided I was going to do it there. I mean, what was I thinking? Uh, I think I do see a fire station, so we can go ahead and loot this place as well. Um, I don't see anything too dangerous. We've got a car there. So we'll go ahead and run right by this. And straight to the fire station. I think that's a fire. Yep, that is definitely a fire station. We got it. I think. <clears throat> Stealth mode activate. Um, time to use some pro gamer skills. Yep, super good. Super good. Um, ah. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, they're not... Oh, they're dropping filters, which are also good, but not what we're looking for, of course. Um, let me see. Around... I don't know what the spawn rate is, but it should be absolutely uh, really high because of my settings, of course. Mm, yes, good. Uh, okay, we'll need to go to another fire state. Oh, hello there. Oh, there's another one. You have a friend? Well, don't worry, because I've got you covered. Oh, crap. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go again on another bullet-killing spree. Well, not a bullet-killing spree, but, like, we're just rampaging again. Straight through town. Mm, yes, okay, uh, yeah. I didn't think that through, but, um... What, what is this devilry? Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, they're coming. Oh, yep, yep, they're definitely coming. Oh, there we go, headshot. Yep, yep. Very good, very good. Uh, watch out. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Okay. Uh, come get some. Okay, please don't be a big dude over there. I think I see one. I think we might have just wiped out a whole town almost. Oh, they're coming up this hill. That's like ridiculous. Stop it. Stop. <laughs> they just keep coming. Oh, we're gonna need to reload. <laughs> uh, there we go. Uh, Okay, we'll have to go through all the loot we got. Some medical gear. Oh, that would have been useful if we got hit. Oh, 
Alright. Um, oh, we're, we're... Okay, we need water. Oh, why won't it... Let me... Okay, good. Because I'm about to die. We have... Oh, wait, we actually have medical gear, so we don't even need to worry. We can just, like, pick it up as we, like, go along and heal ourselves. Not too bad. Um, wasn't the best idea because we wasted 40 rounds of ammo, but I, I'm not really too worried about ammo this early on. I'm going to go ahead and see if we get a gas mask. All right, so because of our little predicament where we can't find a... A, a boat that we can get or a gas mask so we can get a boat um, I think we can go down to one of the campgrounds and there might be a boat spawn there now fingers crossed we're lucky and we get a functional boat which if we do then we can make it into a tank raft which oh wow I just found my car from the first episode and it's completely wrecked uh, yeah, I remember doing this, and I think I posted it in a YouTube short. So, if you guys haven't seen that yet, you can go check that out. It's on my channel, I think. Alright, we are almost... Oh, and look. I mean, th th those are boats, right? We were, we were almost there, and then we found boats. So, good. Um, we have a short boat, or a longer boat. It look no, they're the same length. It doesn't matter. Um, we also have some good ranger loot, but I don't need it because we already got all this stuff basically um, Let me go check over here and see what we got uh, Just another boat oh, look a plane. It's right above us and we're we're right where the tank is also supposed to be That's pretty intimidating, right? But don't worry. He's not dropping bombs. It's just dropping cargo on somebody's head or house or something I don't know Looks like it's going to Zavad, which is close, but, um, I don't really want to go over there right now, and we really need to get this tank thing done. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and see where the tank even is. I think it's close to the bridge. Did we drive over the bridge? Oh, that, that'd suck. Yeah, I think, oh, crap. No, 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 no. Please don't die, please don't die. Uh... <laughs> Don't do it. No. Okay, good. That is, that is very good. Um. Alright. Time to heal. I'm gonna go ahead and move the tank over to an area where we can actually get it onto the boat. Um, basically, what I'm building right now is a platform that will allow the tank to ride right above where I drive. And I'm gonna be able to, hopefully move one tank all the way over to my base using physics that I don't even understand well actually I mean I do um, it's pretty simple it's just putting a boat on a tank or, or putting a tank on a boat I mean we could put a boat on a tank next time but not really right now and I'm not even sure how we'd go about putting a boat on a tank but if you want me to do that go ahead and tell me in the comment section or hop on my discord and tell me there of course the more I build on this boat, the more wobbly it gets. I'm thinking that's going to be an issue. We're going to need some side walls, of course. I already had that in my uh, design plan, which I didn't actually make like a, a blueprint like I usually do for most things, um, where I just sketch it out on a sheet of notebook paper what I plan on it looking like. <laughs> like, literally, that's what I do. It's the most efficient way of coming up with how you want an idea to work is just to get the idea out of your head and then put it on paper. Alright, I am 90% sure that this rudimentary cave, or cage, I, I should, I, I meant to say cage, um, should be able to carry it once we put like some barriers on the back. But in order for us to, dis to do that, we just need to um, get this tank on there. So, I'm 2% sure that we actually can get it on there in the first Oh, oh crap! Uh, that's not good. Um, get get the get the car jack. Where's where's the car jack? Okay, mm, not good. Oh no 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 no! Please don't die! Please don't die! Time. Please don't die! Oh my gosh! Um, it just keeps getting more stuck. I need to okay, get. There we go. Ah yes, wonderful. Um, 
How are we this strong? Strong enough to move a tank? Um, I don't know if it's actually getting damaged, which shouldn't be too bad. I'm gonna have to get the tank out of the water for you guys real quick. Alright, and I've gotten the tank out of the water. It only took me like 10 minutes, but I did it. Um, that's not too bad. So basically, our one issue is that whenever we drive into these, the boat just gets pushed off. So what we need to do is just get it so that way the, the tank will just fall straight into the platform and I think we should be good to go. And I'm all right, I think this is this is probably a bad idea, but I've already set these up, the barriers at the back, and we're gonna try to drop it in. Now, one of the things that could go wrong here is that it will just fall on the boat, and the boat will just sink straight into the water because it's physics. And uh, this, I mean, if we drove it straight on, we wouldn't have had that problem because it, it it's gonna just push the, the the boat down this time, I think. And <gasps> it's done. It's been done, yes. Wonderful. We've we've got a tank on a boat. Oh yes. Uh physics, I do love you. Um Oh my god, we're just Uh that's um, not I'm not sure how I'm supposed to feel about that. I'm just gonna try again. I will say I'm getting better at getting this tank out of the water. It's it's getting easy for me to do this. And as for the boat, um, I'm not really sure how to get the tank on there. Of course, we could just do this and just carjack the tank onto the boat. I'm sure it will splash more that way, but I mean, it'd probably work better. And then as long as we make sure there's a slight amount of elevation between the tank loading layer and the boat itself, it should be perfectly fine. I'm going to go ahead and set that up. And here we go for uh, attempt three. Uh, we're just going to be trying the old method of just driving the tank right onto the boat. And it seems it's worked. Now, physics, please don't be dumb because I really need you to work for me. Uh, please don't do it. Don't, don't, just, just don't break. I really need this to work. <laughs> Oh, we could actually put like two or three tanks from the looks of this. Ah, uh, yes, good. And I'm really not sure how we're supposed to go about dealing with this issue here. Okay, we have a boat on a tank. Or, no, a tank on a boat. Uh, I'm really struggling with words right now, today. <laughs> uh, we really need to make sure this corner doesn't just fall straight into the ocean. Um, we, it's a good thing I have some logs over here from all the tree cutting down. Or tree chopping. Uh, again, word problems. Uh, okay. And this should be a pretty simple fix. All we need to do is make a couple of these crappy small pine plates. Which you don't really use these much, I don't think. Unless you're making like a car. And then these are really useful. Or, or one of these. A boat. Um, a tank carrier. Oh my gosh. There we go, just just a little sidebar like that should do. And then one of these here, wonderful. And okay, physics is taking over now. So let's go ahead and drive ourselves. Oh crap, don't no, please, it's sinking. <laughs> oh gosh, it's a little heavy, isn't it? Oh, okay. Uh, time to go ahead and our float our way back to base with this. Absolutely wonderful thing. Okay, there we go. Um, ah, glorious. Our tank is now... Oh, crap. And physics again. Uh, we're sinking. Because there's a tank on the back. <laughs> um, oh. Ah, the tank's getting launched. Oh, no, the tank is not getting launched. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> what is this? Oh, the tank's still on. No! No, 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 don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. How is... This is... What? <laughs> I have no words to explain this. This is absolutely fantastic. Now all we need to do is somehow manage to get this back on the thing, which I think was easy solution just to do this. I'm gonna see you guys once I get this on. This is interesting. So I got the tank onto the boat, finally, again. Um, and this time I've changed up the design a bit, but I can't get in the boat. 
I'm like, I can't even drive it. Like, the, is the tank in the way? <laughs> is this what's going on here? I'm gonna have to fix this if it is. All right, here we go for our next test. Uh, the tank seems. Oh crap! It's falling off. Uh, let me go try again. Okay, now this is take like 49, and we're about to do it. I think. Uh, let, I, I don't think I can zoom out any farther than this, so... We're, we're basically... Oh, we're out of fuel. Um, that's, that's a slight issue. Okay, we have some in here, so we should be good. Um, okay. Yes? And... The, the, okay. Uh... <laughs> this is the closest we've gotten, and I've determined it is 100% possible to get a tank onto a boat. So I hope you guys have enjoyed because I, I'm pretty done with this um, trying to get the tank on and then having it fall off a few seconds later. So, that being said, um, if you've enjoyed today's episode of The Unturned, please like, comment, and subscribe. Just bludgeon the like and comment, or like and subscribe buttons, of course. Y you know you have to, to help out the channel and uh, help me grow as a YouTuber. Um, and then leave a comment if you if you have any suggestions or ideas for the next episode, because I plan on doing some ridiculous stuff with this tank. I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.